when I was younger. I'm still young anyway. I've read so many history books and so many history pages. I was told that slavery has ended a long time ago. Yet I still see men walking in chains in the necks and likewise in their hands. Not physically, but emotionally and psychologically. And that makes me understand that in as much as we're trying to be free, freedom is still something very, very far from each one and every one of us. I've heard people trying to tell other people that they can do great with their life. But yet when they try to take risks, what's the next thing they tell them? <laughs> do you really believe you can do that? People keep trying to make other people realize that there's a lot of changes they can bet with their lives. Yet when they try to do something really different, something out of the box, something out of the ordinary, the next thing they keep telling them is, stop dreaming, stop wasting your time. That is impossible. So many times I've seen parents trying to tell their kids to be creative. Yet when they do something out of the ordinary according to their own definition of of the box. They keep telling them that that is impossible. Every day of our life, each one and every one of us, that something different we always really want to do. You know, sometimes I see children being born at the hospital, I hear the voice and I set a smile on the faces of their parents when they're born. And I ask myself, I don't just want to be another letter in the alphabetical order. I don't just want to be another page in the book of life without making a difference. I don't just want to leave just because people said I leave. I want to come. I want to see. And I want to conquer. I want people to know that I really came and I really make a difference with my own generations and likewise my own time. You know, the question I'm asking you today is, are you really free? People keep saying that freedom is a state of the mind. But how many of us through deep down in our heart we're really free to express our mind and do the things we really want to do with our life? They're going to tell you, that's too risky. It's a stupid idea. It's not going to work. <laughs> but the truth is this, it always seems impossible until it is done. So never let any man or any woman hold you back from achieving your goals and like what you're achieving your dreams. The people that have better inventions, that bet innovations, the people that made a difference with our times and likewise in a generation, are the people that are actually crazy enough to walk out of the box. I've always trying to be free every day of my life. I've always trying to be free every seconds, every moment of my life. Just the way you've been trying to be free. But my question to you is, are you really free? You know, people keep telling me that oh, when I'm rich, when, when I got a lot of money in my bank account, that's when I can say financially I'm free. Well, financially you might be independent, but that doesn't mean that you're free. Independent doesn't really bet freedom. I've seen a lot of people that say because they are older, because they are in 20 something and 30 something and 50 something, that bet a lot of experience for them. Old age and experience are two different things, just the way it takes no creativity for any man to be violent. So every day of our life, when we wake up, the question we should ask ourselves is, if I'm gone today, what would the world remember me for? I have a lot of words in my heart. I have a lot of things I really want to say. But it's not about the words that I say. It's about what you actually do with your life this moment. Freedom. It's not just a desire. It's a destination. It's, it's not just a destination. It's a lifetime goal. It's something we keep pursuing every day of our life. Just the way our parents, our community, our environment, our lectures, everything around us is telling us how to do it. But the point is you ask yourself is this. Who are the people that define the box, that design the box? Who are the people that actually try to put this in place? These are some people that just woke up on and said, this is how these things should be done. This should be the norms. But I want to see people who are trying to be revolutionaries. I want to see people who are trying to bet inventions out of the ordinary. I want to see people who are trying to live their life out of the definition of what the ordinary man want them to be. Today, if you're listening or you're watching me, I want you to join in the revolution of being a rebel. A rebel of being a change maker, being a life changer, being a history maker. Don't just read history, change history. And at the end of it all, be free like a bird. 
stretch your wings like an eagle, embrace the world of impossibility ahead of you, and let every man and every woman know that you came, you saw, and you were free.